was June 86 when I came here to open uh, Tchaikovsky competition at the age of uh, 10. And this was actually the turning point in my life and that's very interesting to say that the kid of 10 years old um, made his breakthrough already at the age of 10 and that was me. <laughs> uh, I was incredibly fortunate and th this was the uh, thanks to Tchaikovsky competition. It was a very special time for me because coming out of Siberia it was it seemed like a different country, totally different in many aspects. Uh, culturally, um, also humanly, the life was much faster than in my uh, native town in Novosibirsk. Um, and si since then I always kept a very warm uh, um, uh, remembrance of, uh, of uh, Moscow and was always gravitated towards the city. Where else can you see young player uh, playing uh, within uh, uh, 10 days uh, classical repertoire, Baroque, Bach, Mozart, Beethoven, uh, romantic things, Russian traditional uh, repertoire and then finally coming to the uh, final stage of the competition where they have to play not one concerto but two and without a break and not only that the stress and the pressure that they're going to be facing uh, because the whole world is uh, looking towards them uh, the whole world meaning really literally because uh, Medici TV is streaming it live and I think in all the countries of the world, people can see these events. Music is not sport. And there is always uh, somebody who can play faster and uh, louder. <laughs> uh, music is art. How to evaluate artists? That's a big challenge. That's, uh, uh, that is uh, the mission of the jury members, to identify someone who will actually make it in their life. And maybe not with the immediate effect, and maybe the winner uh, this year's um, violin uh, competition uh, will be somebody who the audience will not understand why he or she won. It's important today to give uh, maximum attention and time to your own reflection of your own soul and your own feelings. What I'm really looking forward in the competition is to meet someone who can uh, touch me, not as a, uh, not to impress me only in the uh, virtuoso aspect, but I want to be touched musically. I want to see the seed, at least the seed, of the great tree that can grow. And I would, uh, I would go for this violinist, I would go for this musician. I would encourage him or her.